in order to duplicate this lower third to have more than one instance of this, you'll either need to duplicate the project because this project is kind of self-contained around this one title. Um, and you can do that by saving this as and then re-importing the original project. And you can just continue to do that. And that might be the easiest way. But if you do have this script for After Effects called True Complete Duplicator, and you can get it on aescripts.com, uh, name your own price, you can pay what you want. What happens is you can go to your control comp, you can open up True Comp Duplicator from the window menu, go down to True Comp Duplicator, and you can duplicate the selected once you have these settings set up. And you'll notice that it's duplicating and replacing all the compositions that have unique layers. So now I can go to M4 and M5 and these are completely different compositions now. So now I can go into the first name here and I can change it to Paul Winner and over here I can see that it didn't change on 5. So they're completely separate now and I can change the name here to Mr. Winner. And they're completely separate. So now M4 and M5 are completely different lower thirds that you can bring in with custom text separated with True Comp Duplicator. However, you could also do what I was saying and you could save this project as a different project. So you could say this one is called, we'll call this one All. Then we can re import the original project. the one that wasn't all and now that's all set up so you could just call this you know uh, lower third one so now you'll see in here this M4 we could change it to M5 it's a little tricky but you know that's probably the quickest and easiest way to do it if you don't want to get this plugin that you could just bring the original project in to the same project and just that way you're keeping it all in a single project but they're also separate and now you can change this in this comp as well so, second project. And you can see that that's separate from these other ones. I hope this helps you with what you're trying to achieve here. Uh, please let me know if, if I need to be clearer. And also, thank you very much for using VidEasy to uh, work on your projects.